guys, welcome back to One Mouse, One Dream. So, Brad finally decided to show up. Yeah, yeah, because, um, anyway, mm -hmm. how are y'all doing? Yeah, because you guys, like I said, he worked, he was working opposite shifts, me for, shifts of mine for a long time, so we weren't able to connect to do the hauls. So. Yeah, so I worked for um, a toy company. I'm not going to say who they were. When we moved to Savannah, I took the job, and, um... Getting up at 4 in the morning, 4.30 in the morning every morning, and then working somewhere I didn't feel was right. I know, crazy saying that for a toy company. It just wasn't right. So I left that company last week, and I'm back to normal living hours. So I don't have to be in bed by 8 o'clock at night and be up at 4 in the morning um, and live a normal life so that um, I can enjoy daytime life. So that being said, on to bigger and better things, and more Disney. Yay. So today is going to be just a small little haul video. A few things we picked up at Disney last week when we were there. That we were. And then just a few things we picked up around here, just actually in the last couple days, that are holiday related, and of course, they're Disney. And we just posted two days ago mm -hmm. the Jingle, what's it called? Jingle Bell Jingle Jam. No, Bam. 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 The Sorry. Jingle Gel Bam. No, Jingle Bell Jingle Bam. Anyways, mm -hmm. we posted that video. Please go watch it. You will not regret watching that mm -hmm. new Christmas show that has replaced the Osborne Lights at Hollywood Studios. The video won't justify the, the high quality, crazy, awesome. but just watch it because it is awesome. And yeah. I hope they do it every year because it's well worth it. So go check out that video that we posted on Sunday. Yep. Right? Mm hmm Okay. Yep. So speaking of Hollywood Studios and Christmas, the night that we were there, we decided to pick up two items and we... Fell, well, I fell in love with one of the items, and then Brad decided to get the other one too, just because we do like to collect our cups throughout the parks. And the first one is the one that Brad picked out, and this is a holiday mug, I guess you would call it. I think you can get it at other parks too, but it's really cute. It says Happy Holidays, has Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs all over it. They're, you know, decorating a Christmas tree, which is really cute. And then what's on the other side? I forget. Scroll. Keep it's all. Oh, there's it's just all seven. Oh, yeah, that's right. There's a fireplace on the other side. That's why. Yeah, so super cute. And these were what? $8? $6.95. Oh, $6.95 with a drink. No refill. No refill. Then the item that I picked out and fell in love with, he just had to come home with us. Look how cute this is. Um, so this is a popcorn container. You got it filled with popcorn. And um, it has like this really nice little shoulder strap on it. So I will take the strap off to use it throughout the house. And I thought it'd be cute in the kitchen to put Christmas cookies in or something like that. But the top opens here and inside was popcorn filled to the top. And they actually kept the lid open when you got the popcorn. So it filled up even into the hat too. They gave us popcorn. And you could get a refill for popcorn for $1.50 on these. And I just think it's really cute. He's holding his, you know, Santa sack, I guess you could say, and just loved it. This was a little bit pricier. I think these were $13.99, right? $13. Oh, $13. And then, like I said, he got a $1.50 refill. So, pretty cool. Great and little yes, decoration. Yes, we know. If I'm not mistaken, these have been previous years. But mm -hmm. for the first time being to Walt Disney World for Christmas, this was new to us. Mm -hmm. So, so we had excited. to have it. But they're pretty cool. Yeah. And speaking of not really new, but, um, but new to us, we picked up the well, You Are Here um, Epcot mug. And it's actually sort of cool that we waited because they're doing the extra 20% off right now for um, annual pass discount. And you can get the 20% off on all the, the Starbucks mugs. So we'll definitely probably pick up the last two that we need, which is Animal Kingdom and Magic Kingdom. So there's the last two that we need. But it's really cool because we get to get an extra 20% off. 
So the next two items that I purchased are actually holiday pins. Again, I'm not going to trade them. Um, I'm just going to probably wear them throughout the holidays. The first one that I picked up was Santa Mickey. And I thought he's really cute. And this was silver, so he was $8.99. And then, of course, got the extra 20% off. And then the next one I fell in love with. This is Mickey and Minnie ice skating, and they're smooching, too. Super cute. Also silver, so $8.99, but then 20% off. Super excited to have these for the holiday to wear them, you know, to go to work or something. Um, just think they're really cute. Last item that I picked up, well, Brad was there with me, but last item we both picked up is this gingerbread cookie ornament from the Grand Floridian. And you actually can eat this, but it's obviously more for decoration, but I think people end up eating it at the end. Um, I thought it was really pretty. So there's all different kinds of sugar decorations all throughout it. It does say Happy Holidays 2016. I'm not really sure because if we're going to end up eating it or if we'll end up just savoring it from year to year. What do you guys do with yours? Because this was our first year going to the holiday, you know, gingerbread house at the Grand Floridian, and I'm not sure what your thoughts are. But it smells heavenly. So did the gingerbread house. I just loved it. It was awesome. And highly, highly recommend going throughout the resorts to see the decorations. Even though not, of them, not all of them are up yet, but super cute. And this was $10, I believe. Something like that. And no discount on that. And then the next two items I actually just purchased last night. I'm so excited. I finally, 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 finally found them. And that is the Glad Tupperware Disney Holiday Containers. They only had two different sizes. This is the large square, and then I got the large rectangle. And what's super cute about them is, of course, they have Disney on the sides. Let me get one of them to show you. And then the same the design on both sizes. It's just the difference as far as one square, one's rectangle. So there's Mickey. And then this one says, happy holidays, right? Oh, holiday joy, <laughs> sorry. This one says, holiday joy. And then this side says, season's greetings. So again, super cute. I don't know how well they'll hold up, but they were on sale at our Kroger's for only $2.99 for a pack of two. So again, I got the square ones as well as the rectangle ones. And Brad's getting up because we have something big, something very big to share with you guys. And I'm very excited about this. Ah! So let me get the chair out of the way. So Brad picked up this Disney um, holiday train, which I'm so, so excited. We already took it out of the box and sort of played with it already. Um, but we're gonna wait till we get our tree so we can put it around the tree. Oops. But it's really cute. There's this little house here, like a snow chalet, that um, lights up and things. The locomotive part plays music and things too, which is really cute. The caboose part where the characters are at, they go up and down. It's not the Disney like parks one, but we thought it was really cool and it was only... How much? Like, I got it for 40 bucks. Yeah, so for 40 bucks you got it on sale. So. I thought it was a really good deal compared to like the $130 one. Not that that one's not really cool, but again, this is something nice to add to our holiday decorations this year. And we'll definitely do... Oh yeah, here's a big picture of it. So it's super cute, and it does come along with little like signs that you can post throughout. And you can do two different track layouts, an oval shape or a round. So really, really excited about this one. And we... We'll definitely do a video once we get the tree up and the tree decorated and things so that y'all can see what it looks like, how it sounds, and so and so forth. So we hope y'all have a great day. And this will actually be, I guess, our only live vlog for this week. And so I guess we can wish y'all a very happy Thanksgiving and a blessed Thanksgiving with all your friends and family. And we just hope that y'all can, you know, gather together and enjoy this special time of the year. And give thanks. Mm -hmm. yep. See you real soon.
Bye guys.